so another exercise that we want all of our patients to be able to do is a squat. Okay, a squat is one of the best exercises that we can do to actually engage the core and engage a lot of the muscles within the lower extremity. So it's essential that we learn how to do a proper squat. But there's a progression. It can be very, very hard and it can take a long time to actually master your squat. So Dr. Heather's got a pretty good squat, so she's going to demonstrate for us. And what we're going to start with is just a simple chair um, squat. Okay, so if you're dealing with any SI instability, if you have recurring SI subluxations and we're trying to stabilize those, or if you have any lower back complaint, it's absolutely vital that we strengthen these lower extremities to get that pelvic stability, okay? So here's what Dr. Heather is going to do. She's going to get a chair, um, the proper height to where when she actually sits down on it and she comes down, her knees are at 90 degrees, okay? And all she's going to do is she's going to push her bottom back, Okay, so she's going to push her bottom back and she's going to sit in that chair. So through this entire exercise, what we're trying to do always is we're trying to maintain a neutral spine. Okay, so you can see that she's actually making the motion with her hips. So she's coming down and then she's pushing up through her hips as well. Okay, you notice that her knees, when she comes down, they're staying behind her toes. Okay, we don't want the knees to actually come in front of the toes. Alright, so go ahead and come down again. Good. And then you see that she's coming down nice and easy into the chair, okay? What we don't want people to do is we don't want you to just flop down into the chair. Okay, so if Dr. Heather shows that, if somebody just goes too fast and just falls down in the chair, that's not what we want, okay? We want her actually pushing through her heels, coming up, extending through the hips, and coming gradually, nice and easy, down into the chair. All at the same time, she's engaging your core like we always do. So if I was going to come hit her in the stomach, she'd kind of push everything out, engage that core. Nice neutral spine through this entire um, exercise. We don't want too much extension, and we definitely don't want to round this lower back during a squat, especially when we actually load the spine or put any weight on it. Okay, So there's the chair squat progression. That's where we like to start people to just practice your squat.